Geobyte. Welcome to Geobyte. Hi kids. Good morning. How are you all? Had your breakfast? In the previous video, we have seen the topics find the missing numbers, mental maths and practice time. In this video, we will cover the topics E Sangeeta write story problems. Now, let us get into the topic E Sangeeta write. Hey kids! One day, Sangeeta went to the market with her grandpa. She saw the prices and said to her grandpa, Let us see them one by one and check whether Sangeeta is right or wrong. First, let us see a bit. We have geese, one or two rupees, costlier than biscuits. Sangeeta said that geese, one or two rupees, costlier than biscuits. Children, what is the cost of biscuits? 25 rupees. And what is the cost of ghee? 127 rupees. To find whether the cost of ghee is more, that is 1 or 2 rupees more, we need to subtract 127 and 25. Let us do these sums without using book and pencil. Children, let us split 127 into 120 plus 7. Minus 25 as 20 plus 5. Now, first, let us subtract 120 minus 20. 120 minus 20 is 100 and 7 minus 5 is 2. 100 plus 2, 102. So, what Sangeeta said is right, that is, ghee is 102 rupees costlier than biscuits. Right. Now, let us see the B bit. Price of oil and ghee all together is more than rupees 200. To find the sentence is correct or not, we need to add the cost of oil and ghee that is 70 plus 127. 70 plus, now let us split 127 into 120 plus 7. 70 plus 120 plus 7. First, let us add 70 plus 120 which is 190. 190 plus 7, it is 197. So, Sangeeta said is more than rupees 200, but it is 197. She said the sentence wrong. Now, let us see C bit. Price of ghee and 10 kg rice is less than rupees 300. Children, to find out the price of ghee and 10 kg rice is less than 300, we need to add the price of ghee and the price of rice, that is 10 kg rice. So, what is the price of ghee? 127 rupees. And the price of 10 kg rice, 150 rupees. So, let us split them. 127 can be split as 120 plus 7 plus 150. First, let us add 120 plus 150. 
120 plus 150 is 270 plus 7 is 277. So, she said less than 300. That is 277 is less than 300. So, what she said is right. Now, let us see the debate. Oil costs rupees 40 more than a pack of biscuits. Children, to find whether the given sentence is correct or not, we need to subtract the cost of oil and the cost of biscuits. That is 70 minus 25. Children, 70 minus 25 is 45. The given sentence is Oil costs rupees 40 more than a pack of biscuits. But actual one is Oil costs rupees 45 more than a pack of biscuits. So, this sentence is wrong. Now, let us get into the topic, story problems. Hey kids, see here. Nisha and Sono were making story problems. Nisha said, 13 boys and 14 girls in a class. Sonu, can you make a problem on it? Children, Nisha and Sonu are making problems on some stories. So, Nisha said that 13 boys and 14 girls in a class. Then, she asked Sonu to make a question on that. Then, the Sonu has written that there are 13 boys and 14 girls in a class. How many students are there all together? So, from that story, the Sonu made this question. Similarly, we will also make some questions on some stories. Children, now we have a story here. That is, 36 men and 52 women waiting for their turn. From this story, we will make a question. That is, 36 men. First, let us write the story as it is. 36 men and 52 women are waiting for their turn. Now what the question I will make is how many people are waiting all together. Children, from this story I have made this question. That is, 36 men and 52 women are waiting for their turn. How many people are waiting all together? Now, we have another story here. Let us make a question from this story. First, let us read the story. We have our midday meal in 20 minutes and play for 15 minutes. Children, first let us write this story as it is. That is, we have our midday meal In 20 minutes.
and play for fifteen minutes. Children, now let us make the question. We can make a question like this. What is the total time taken by us to have our midday meal and play? Let us write. What is the total time taken? by us to have our midday meal and to play. Now we have made our question. That is, we have our midday meal in 20 minutes and play for 15 minutes. What is the total time taken by us to have our midday meal and to play? Children, now let us see another story. The post office is one kilometer from Shahid's home and two kilometers from his school. From this story, we will make a question. First, let us write the story as it is. The post office is one kilometer far from Shahid's home and two kilometers Far from his school. Now, what is the question I will make from the story is How much far is Shahid's school from his home? How much far is Shahid's home from his school? Children, see, this is the question I have made from this story. The post office is one kilometer far from Shahid's home and two kilometers far from his school. How much far is Shahid's home from his school? Now let us see this story. Bunty has read 27 books and Bubbly has read 34 books. Children, now let us make a question from this story. Before that, let us write this story as it is. Bunty has read 27 books. And 
bubbly has red thirty four books from this story let us make a question that is who read more books and by how many let us write who read more books and by how many now we have made the question let us see the question bunty has read 27 books and bubbly has read 34 books who read more books and by how many the remaining topics will be covered in the next video you are welcome to contact us on telegram to clarify your doubts regarding these topics check out the link in the description thank you for watching please do like share comment and subscribe to geobyte geobyte